Hey everyone, it's Beth Sullivan and Rylan Sullivan. How are you all? Hope you're doing great. Aiden is going to be Hi. behind the scenes today, but he's here helping too. So we are here with um, some of our parrots, right? And behind me is the angel parrot tree that we've been talking about for a while. And we are going to tell you what you guys can do this holiday to help keep us up and running because we need help. And um, I'm working on my 501c3. Um, that still is something I do need help I, with financially. That's going to cost about $500 more dollars to have that finalized. Um, but I do have my nonprofit status with the state of Florida, so I can run as business and we have been doing that and it's been awesome we've been able to take in lots of birds and we have been able to rehome five of them right now we currently have 13 birds here Four, in the we have 14 yeah we have 14 you see a 14 I, I missed um we also have um you know a lot of things to cover with their food costs and toys and um lots of veterinary care because a lot of the birds that come to us need veterinary care right uh -huh. So one of the things that we are um, very much about is making sure that we, um, when we do rehome these birds, it has been a large cost to us, but we want to be able to give that at a low cost to someone who's going to be a very good owner for that bird and who can also afford to take care of that bird, right? And also who, um, you know, somebody who is a good fit. And in order to do that, that takes a lot of veterinary care, there's a lot of costs involved, and of course, a lot of um, stuff on our part as far as watching them and keeping track of their daily needs and things that they do. So, we need your help. So here's how it's gonna work. We have this beautiful angel tree. Now, there is something very important missing from this tree. Um, my amazing friend Catherine has, has made handmade the most beautiful little parrots to go on my tree and they're all feathered and they're beautiful but they're in the mail they're coming so um people that donate two hundred dollars or more will get one with their don't they'll get the free gift purchase and they're so cool you guys i don't even know how i'm gonna give these away they're so amazing oh uh, i can't wait to see them in person i've seen videos of them um so if you make at least a 200 hundred dollar donation then you get a gift with purchase um we have a couple of other um, smaller donations that you're gonna get with gifted purchase as well, 150. I think we might have a hundred dollar one on there too. So we have tons of ornaments as you can see, and all of the ornaments have a name of. Um, Would you like me to read them out? A bird, and here are some. I'll have Rylan read some examples. Um, if you want to donate, I am going to create a link. Um, but right now, um, it's gonna be a Venmo is at, Rain at Rainbow Parrot Rescue Florida. That's our Venmo, and then our PayPal is um, just our email address, which is Rainbow Parrot Rescue Florida at yahoo.com. So you can go ahead and you can also follow us on Instagram. But for the donations, if you want to make a comment that you've donated or that you want to donate, um, please share this and uh, make sure that you comment below as well. And again, I will make sure that there's a link in this. So, Rowan, just read a couple examples of different um, ornaments that are on this tree. So right here we get Zerg, which $30 donation for foraging toy for him. Okay. Um, we got up here, Tangaroa, um, a Kinter, I think that's what this is. Yeah, that's his favorite toy. Kintor, um, large wood toy, $40 okay. donation. Okay. Down here we got $150 donation for a... Um, that's just if they give a general donation and they get a free gift with purchase. Now yes, it's one of the general. parrots, so we're going to have a couple of those to give away. They're under the $200 mark that I've created on the street here. Um, if you do go ahead, like there's also some very general $40 gifts as well. Uh, what we're going to do is we're going to take your name and um, dry it with a dry eraser and write it on the back of the angel tree. Yep. And we'll have that um, at the end of the year. Um, we'll be able to see everybody's donation. We'll be able to Personally, um, as much as we can, thank everybody for doing so. Um, and I, we just really want to make sure that we stand out in the state of Florida as far as... Hi, Garnet! Hi, Garnet. <laughs> as far as um, keeping track of our birds and keeping the best possible care, giving them the very best conditions um, to live in. And uh, when we rehome them, the same thing is that they, we are giving them the absolute best that they can possibly get. Um, that, so there's no other homes in between if they leave our home. So that is what we are trying to do. So we are going to make sure, and if you want to donate to a certain bird, um, we have six macaws. Um, I'll make sure I write all of their names down. Um, they all have different stories. They all come from different places. Um, we had some great prior owners that we are so grateful for that have given them to us because you know they had rescued them. 
we also have um, just some really strange situations like all over. We've had them left in our driveway, we've had birds left at our doorstep. We've had birds from all over. A lot of stories. So, um, and we want to still be able to take in more and of course we want to be able to adopt out more. Um, but I can't do that until we have more funding and I, and I will be getting a grant researcher. If you guys know a good one, please let me know. Um, it costs a couple thousand sometimes even just to feed them um, for a couple months. So it can be a lot um, with their toys and everything. So we definitely need funding. We need to be able to have, um, you know, grants, right, buddy? Yeah. And um, we also need to be able to have, you know, people that are, you know, regular givers as well to keep us up and running. So that's what we're, our whole goal is this season. I was really inspired to do an, um, an angel tree because of just the past, I've always, I've always been able to take an ornament off and be like, oh, really, I really love, you know, Tenga is my favorite bird and I love, you know, Ruby Macaws and I want to be able to give him a toy this, this year. I will, we will do that for you. Um, just like you would a regular angel tree. We have, um, there are birds all eat Harrison's, which is a pelleted diet. Of course, they do get some chop that Dan makes, <laughs> but from Bird Tricks. So thank you. But we also have, um, we don't only have them for our macaws. We have them for like Juliet, which is one of our cockatiels. Yeah, and she's one of our rescue and cockatiels. And Chris so that is like a foul pound bag of Harrison's and um, the Harrison's that we feed them. Um, Harrison's is basically all the same pretty much, but it's just the size of the pellet that's different. So there's a course, the Harrison's course that we feed them, um, pelleted, that's for the macaws and the African grays. Um, and then there's a small, like a super a fine and a super fine so that we can feed to the cockatiels and the Quaker, that type of thing. That, so. Um, and Iris, <laughs> our scarlet tested parrot. The fine, the fine Harrisons are better for the cockatiels and Kermit. Right. So. so we have those donations as well. Um, if you guys are more comfortable, I've had a lot of people message me like, "Hey, I just want to um, Amazon something to you. Can I have your address?" I'm totally fine doing that. I will private message you. Just let me know um, in the comments below. I've had people just um, call me and just say, hey, I love my parrots around this type of food and I really would love to, you know, donate. I really want you to try this, you know, New perfectly. Food. Yeah, we've, and we've really been, you know, impressed with some of that. We, people have been very helpful as well. Um, we've had people, you know, drop stuff at our doorstep with donations with toys and such. Um, if you know macaws, you know, they eat... They play with a lot of toys, healthy ones anyways, a lot. Tanga eats a lot of wood. Yeah, he's our most destructive, but that's actually a really good thing because... Because he needs to do it for his beak, because his beak needs to be really good, healthy, yep. and strong. Yep, so that's actually a really good thing for a makate. They will go through a, two by, a couple of two by fours of just wood in like a day or two. So it's it's a lot. Their toys can get really expensive, but we love them and we really want to make sure that they all have really good homes and if they're staying with us that they can live here in the sanctuary and we can keep providing for them that we, the way that we have been able to do so. Um, and just like anything else, I do treat this like a, a business. So of course I love the animals, but I do have to make sure that we have the funds to continue doing this. Um, and it is a nonprofit, so it's not like we're making money. We have been a lot, we've been doing this out of our own pocket. Um, a lot, a lot of this out of our own pocket. So there has been some really great donations and we've appreciated it. Um, but all of our birds are microchipped. They're all wellness checked at the vet at Exotic Bird Hospital. Um, we get them on wellness plans. Um, we've done a lot for the birds, so we um, we want to continue. We want to continue to do that, and we want to be able to take in more as well and rehome some of the ones that we've kind of rehabbed. So in order to do that, we need your help. So I'm going to give you a little bit more here. Other other um, parts of the tree here, you can kind of see. But we have a lot. We've done a lot with this. These awesome trees. They have a $75. We have a $75 donation in general. Uh, crystal. Small toys, toy cockatiel toy. toys. And um, and let's see here. Oh, hi, Kira. Hi, love. How are you? Can you say hi to everyone? Say hi, Kira. Huh? She's shocked. We don't know why, but she's shocked. Right? Are you a goofball? Are you a goofball? Okay, and who else we got? Oh, this is Malibu. Oh. Hi, Mally. She's a Harlequin. She's a sweet girl. So, and I've got my teals here behind us on the stand here. You can see them. How cute are they? I asked it. Astrid was doing peekaboo with us um, a little while ago. He's so cute. So anyways, again, thank you all so very much. I wanted to at least get this out to introduce you all today to um, 
to what we're do- Hi, Kermit. <laughs> what we're going to be doing with our angel parrot rescue uh, tree, our angel tree, our parrot tree. So uh, we definitely need your help. Um, so if please you, share this. So if you donate, you will get your name on the donation. Yes, and if you just want again, if you want to make a general donation, if you want to um, see, I'm going to try to post pictures of all the different ornaments that we have up here. We will do lives as much as possible. Please share them. Tag your friends. Um, and again, for donations, it will be uh, Venmo is at Rainbow Pair Rescue Florida. And yeah. then um, our PayPal is our email address, which is at Rainbow, at our Rainbow, Rainbow Parrot, Parrot Rescue, Rescue Florida. Florida at Yahoo.com. <laughs> <laughs> Goofball. So again, um, thank you so much, everybody who has donated so far. We are just starting this for Christmas, and we hope to do this through the new year. So we will be um, up here live a lot over the holidays. Um, and again, we will name all the parrots if you want to donate to a specific parrot, if there's a certain breed that you really want to donate to. Um, right now, <laughs> this is this is my life. Hi, Mally. Come here. Step up. And Kira's laughing at her. Mally's on her banister. She's chilling. Thanks, Mally. She's such a goofball. Mally, what am I going to do with you? See, this is, I was every day. We just saw her head behind the tree and it's popping out. Jeez. Met with her. She shocked. Oh. Anyway, so again, thank you all so much. Um, we will again we'll read off all the different the different um, donations that we're looking for. And um, if you want to just do an amount, just message me. If you want to send something to the house instead, if it's better, if you want to Amazon something, please just by all means private message me. But whatever you do. Be sure to comment below and um, just so we can keep track of everybody as well. And of course, you can private message me too. Thank you so much. And remember, the little parrots that Catherine made are amazing and they're coming soon. I should probably get them in the next, maybe tomorrow or the next day, right? Yep. All right, so. I've seen them and they're cool. They're really cool. I don't even know how I'm going to give these away. I really don't. They're think They're so cool. So thank you guys. Merry Christmas um, to the season. So thank you for giving. Um, we really, really appreciate it. Bye.